Shut the front door, Phil. Wee, guys! Wee, guys! Woo! Shut the front door, Phil. <laughs> Do you mean to tell me that this year marks the 39th anniversary of the Red Rock Balloon Rally? 39 years ago, we started that rally, and uh, it was actually started as a competition between us and Farmington. Oh, wow. Farmington said they had the best place to fly. Right. We knew, of course, that we'd got the best place to fly. <laughs> and so a friendly competition was started, and right. 39 years later, we have a balloon rally. Sweet. Farmington doesn't. Wow. We win. <laughs> Absolutely. And just knowing your background a little, I know you're very, very competitive, so I know probably that's the reason, right? <laughs> well, I don't know that I have everything to do with it, but yeah, we have right. a great group of volunteers who puts it on. Absolutely. Viewers, I'm hanging out here with the man, the dude, the legend, Bill Lee, the real Bill Lee. Oh, boy. <laughs> and we're actually uh, I'm just getting the inside scoop of this upcoming 39th annual balloon rally, one of the second largest uh, balloon rally in North America, is that correct? Well, we used to be number two, and okay. um, we are currently somewhere in the top five okay. um, in terms of size and number of balloons. Um, in the year 2000, we had over 200 balloons, and making us the second largest at that time. Right. But since then, um, what we've decided to do is draw back on numbers a little bit and focus on quality versus quantity. Nice. But we're still one of the largest in the world, yes. Awesome, awesome. That's bad. So uh, can you elaborate a little bit about, you know, what's taking place, maybe dates, events, uh, just a little snapshot of the agenda, what's happening sure. this coming weekend? Sure. So on Thursday, um, December 5th, we will have our first registration. But that will be the first wave of pilots who come in who are planning to fly with us on Friday. Sometimes um, not everybody can get off for the entire three days, so we'll have two registrations, right. one on Thursday and one on Friday. But the, Perfect. the biggest will be on Thursday, and we'll have a lot of pilots coming in, and they'll be at the El Rancho, which is our headquarters. Awesome. They'll come in, register. Some of them get to meet their sponsors, get to meet their crew people, all of that. So it's a big time, um, and that starts Thursday evening. Then Friday morning, we will have our first mass ascension. Friday morning's Mass Ascension is a little different. We do it from two locations. One, okay. from the Fox Run Golf Course here in Gallup. Perfect. And also out at Red Rock Park. Okay. The Fox Run Golf Course is a great place to go and watch the balloons lift off. Sweet. Especially if you want to stay warm, mm -hmm. because you can go to um, RMCH, go to the third floor, and the Auxilians put on a great pancake breakfast there. Oh, wow. From the third floor, where you've got an incredible panoramic view of the balloons taking off from the golf course, awesome. and you don't have to get out in the cold. I'm so, sold. <laughs> so that's a good thing. Um, then, of course, we also have another mass ascension that takes place out at the Red Rock Park, and there will be about 50 balloons at each of those locations. So that happens Friday morning. Then Friday night, we have the Glow in the Rocks. The Glow in the Rocks is one of our actual newest events inside the Red Rock Balloon okay. Rally. Um, several years ago, we decided to start doing a second balloon glow because they're so popular. Right. So we do this one on Friday night out at Red Rock Park. Okay. And while the balloons are glowing, we also have Native American dances by a huge bonfire. Oh, awesome. So the dancers are dancing, the balloons are glowing. It's a pretty spectacular sight to see. Um, this year, the Apache Crown Dancers will be our featured dance group. And so it'll be a great wow. evening. Um, then Saturday morning, we'll have our next um, mass ascension, all the balloons, We'll be launching from Red Rock Park on Saturday morning. Then Ooh. Saturday afternoon is the big Christmas parade downtown. Right. And then Saturday night, the big balloon glow at the Rio West Mall, which we call the Blue Minari. Ooh. Then Sunday, another mass ascension mm -hmm. and um, a farewell brunch for the pilots and their crews and anybody else who wants to participate for that matter. Right. Come on out, get some breakfast. And we have um, an award ceremony and um, an auction for mm -hmm. great, beautiful, Native American art and joy. Wow. Yeah. Sounds like a very, very eventful weekend. Your homeboy, Gio Baia. Shut the front door, Phil. <laughs>